Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to ForsaGeek.com. My name is Atlee Green, and this is the video portion of my column this week, which is titled The Road to Episode 7. Now, as you see, I have a box here that says Star Wars Smuggler's Bounty. As you know, Funko is now doing their own exclusive Star Wars box, kind of like Loot Crate, where you can get exclusive stuff only in this certain box. Now, Marvel's doing it, Loot Crate's doing it, and now Star Wars is doing it. So this box is exclusive. Every Star Wars piece of merchandise that I have here is only going to be in this box. So let's open the box and see what we got. As you can see, haven't opened it yet. I am going to tear this open. Don't want to ruin the box too much. Okay, so let's see what goodies we got inside. All right, so we have a patch that's that with a. Oh, that's pretty cool. We have this new patch as a Star Wars First Order. It's a picture of the a First Order Elite Tie Fighter pilots with the new symbol for the First Order. So that's pretty cool. I'm not really much of a patch person, but. This could be like a cool desk ornament or something that I use at my office. Uh, and on top here we got this we got this pretty cool pin of Kylo Ren. It's a Star Wars on top with Kylo Ren. And it has the native language of Star Wars, Arabesh, on the bottom of the pin. So that's pretty cool. I think I'll look it up later tonight and see what it translates to. Now let's see what else we got inside yeah, okay, so, oh, all right, so this is pretty cool. We have a Star Wars lanyard. It says Star Wars The Force Awakens, and it has Funko Pop illustrations of various stormtroopers, and one of Captain Phasma, one of a regular stormtrooper. So this is pretty cool. I go to a lot of, you know, conventions, and I cover a lot of the conventions, so... This should be a pretty cool thing to wear with your lanyard, so that's pretty cool. And hopefully I can, got my fingers crossed, hopefully I can get to a press screening of Star Wars The Force Awakens. But uh, I'm not behind the totem pole, so let's, so fingers crossed, people. Let's see what else. All right, we have a, a exclusive t-shirt that comes in every single Smuggler's Bounty package. And, oh, this isn't bad at all. I like this a lot, actually. It's a Funko Pop illustration of Kylo Ren. If you've been living under a rock, Kylo Ren is the new bad guy in the Star Wars universe come December 18th for The Force Awakens. So this is pretty cool. You know, get a good look at that shirt. You know, I'm really digging that. You know, I'm, I'm really digging that. So um, some people will say to me, why would you want to buy a t-shirt of a toy? But... I can get behind this all day. Now, I'm trying not to look because if you've been on the internet, uh, Star Wars actually advertised there are going to be two exclusive Funko Pop figures in the Smuggler's Bounty, the inaugural Smuggler's Bounty box. And the first one is a Chrome Captain Phasma. Now, that is pretty nice. That is pretty nice right there. Um, I know some people like to keep them but I like to play with my toys so I'm gonna open this up here all right so there you go get a look at the chromed out Captain Phasma I like this a lot look at that that is just beautiful I, I love the shine on the head the helmet I like the they I like the plastic cape here that's a really nice stiff plastic you see the head bobbling around there and the one thing I always like about the, the Star Wars Funko figures is the fact that it comes with a Star Wars stand. So you can either keep your Star Wars action figure on the stand like this, or you can take it off the stand and have it look just like all the other Funko figures. So that's pretty cool. That's the one thing that Star Wars provides with their action figures as far as Funko goes that no one else really provides. Now, there's a second Funko figure in here, Funko Pop, that wasn't advertised. So I'm keeping my eyes closed, and 
Okay, and it is a, oh, a TIE Fighter Pilot. All right, I can get behind this too. All right, and this is, and both of these Funko Pop figures are exclusive to the Star Wars Smuggler's Bounty series. Now, it does say here on the back that there were two different TIE Fighter Pilots. You can get the straight black helmet, the all black helmet, or you can get the helmet with the red stripes going down the middle, signifying that they are an elite first order uh, TIE Fighter pilot. I didn't get the elite one, but this is still pretty cool. And of course, I'm gonna take it out of the box here, because I do that kind of thing. And, oh, the stand. Ah, but all right, so there we are in all his or her glory is the first order TIE Fighter pilot. Very good figure. I definitely like the detail of the figure. Let's put him next to Captain Phasma. So, if you, if you seen the Star Wars trailers, you know that the TIE Fighters, piloted by this gentleman right here and Captain Phasma, are going to cause a whole bunch of trouble come December 18th. So, I like adding these to my collection. They'll look good in my office. Um, but other than that, thank you very much for joining me on this video as we review the Smuggler's Bounty. As you look at the box here, I do just want to say one quick thing that when I actually found this at my doorstep, I noticed that it wasn't packed in any additional packaging. Um, it looked just like this with the Star Wars logo hanging all out on the on my porch. And I was a little concerned about that because I was thinking to myself, if somebody would have walked, would have walked by my house and saw this big box labeled Star Wars, they could have easily walked off with it. And again, this is my first time ordering a Loot Crate type subscription box. so. Uh, but besides, so maybe that's how all the boxes do that. So besides that one little thing, I am very happy. Uh, between the lanyard, the pen, which I'll find something for, this, the awesome, awesome t-shirt, and the two Funko Pops, I say this is definitely worth the price of admission. This costs $25, and I say this is well worth it. Well, folks, once again, thank you. This is Atlee Green from ForcesOfGeek.com signing off. Until next time.